Hello, welcome to my channel, Simply Gifted Power One. If you find that this reading resonate with you, please hit the like button. Please comment down below. Please subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you never miss out on any of your, I said any of your, any of my uploads. Um, if you're a new subscriber, thank you so much for joining. Subscribing, I really appreciate you. Thank you so much for joining. If, if you're a returning subscriber, gang, gang, welcome back. Somebody want me to get this message out already. That's the energy I'm feeling, y'all. This is kind of crazy how this happened. Anyways, we're going to get into it, y'all. But, um, yeah, I really appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much for y'all support. I really love you all. Hope everyone's being safe and enjoying this new year. You know, I know people are start, starting to set new goals and stuff. You know, realistic goals. So, you know. And, you know, so... Also, if you're inquiring about personal readings, the other thing will be listed down below. Now, pile one, this is hilarious because the cards, I didn't choose the cards today. I didn't choose the decks. The decks chose me. I keep my tarot cards, you know, in a little bag here or not, you know, separated or whatever. But the cards fell out, like certain decks fell out. So the decks that fell out, I'm using these decks for y'all reading. Like, I feel like this topic that I'm doing, it's like y'all must gonna be stirring up a lot of shit that's the energy i'm feeling you're gonna be stirring up a lot of shit this year in general y'all gonna be stirring up a lot of shit into into intuitively i feel like i'll be stirring up a lot of shit this year i feel like it's a heavy energy i'm picking up with y'all focusing on goals or you're planning certain things that y'all want to get done you know you look you're taking stuff that you didn't do last year that you want to get done this year you know you want to take a different approach to certain things already starting to look at things from a different lens you know that's the energy I'm starting to get, you know, so yeah, y'all could want to be more independent for some of y'all, or y'all could want to do go solo on certain things. That is the energy I'm getting. Some of y'all want to really put more into yourself. Yourself, that's the energy I'm getting. I feel like that's gonna start pissing people off because when it starts showing up, it hits different. I'm hearing hit different, hit different, hit different, hit different. Oh, so okay, let me start. Anyways, I don't know why y'all. I'm so geek because the energy is like. I'm oh I'm getting little I'm getting um bad baby I'm geeked up something mm, mm. I don't know all the lyrics to that song but I'm getting bad baby geeked up I think I don't know if it's with Lil Yachi I don't know who it's with or Tory Lanez oh, speaking of him anyways like I don't know I don't know um yeah I don't know who exactly it is but that's the energy it's like we're gonna get to these cards but that's what I have to tell y'all so oh we got dreams okay so we got dreams and we got patience in reverse oh 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 okay power one come through power one come the fuck through this is what i'm talking about this is exactly what i'm fucking talking about we got dreams and patient in reverse you know what that lets me know some of y'all dreams are going to start coming in quicker than you expected. The patient is being reversed. Let me show these motherfucking cards. Let me show you these motherfucking cards. Okay, let me show y'all. Okay. Anyways, Paul one. This is the energy. The reason why your blessings are going to piss people off and the reason why you're going to be pissing people off is your dreams or things that you want are going to start happening for you very quickly. Like if you want a new car, you're going to get a new car. You want a new home, you're going to get a new home. You want to start a new business, it's going to start growing rapidly. If you already have a business, it's going to start picking up pace, growing rapidly. You are going to feel, people are going to feel like you're in the front of the line. I'm hearing, I'm hearing... I'm hearing, um, what's that fucking verse? Oh, it's in my head right there. It's like some slow down for what? Who are you in front of? So people are gonna be like some a slow down for what? Who are you in front of? That's a, um Rocky B said that in one of her songs. So it's just like the energy is like, where are you going? That you need to be rushing. Where are you going? You know that you need to be doing all of this. Where are you going? Who are you in front of? You know, basically like slow down for what? <laughs> who are you in front? Of? You know what I'm saying? It's this energy where people may want you to slow down your process to make them. Oh, yes. It's, I'm getting power one and you're going to notice and your bus is going to piss people off. And the reason why you're going to know it's going to be pissing them off is because they're going to want to minimize what you do. They're not going to want to sh like show expression like, oh, power one actually working hard and they're doing this and all of that. They're not going to want to show expression to the things that you're doing. They're going to want to like, oh, okay, that's cool. That's great. You know, keep it really mi minimalistic, not really feed into it. Too much you know 
and you're gonna be doing really big shit making big shits making big moves for yourself but i feel like there's gonna be energies where people are gonna feel some type of way it's almost like these people want you to dim your light for them to feel good about themselves dim your light to make them feel like oh, okay you know i'm still doing good so i feel like if these people are not in the place of doing well they're not gonna want you to do well especially if you're doing better than them so this is the energy and i feel like the reason why your blessings are going to piss people off is because again we got the dream card and we got the patience and reverse as i'm looking at this dream card it's a girl laying on a tiger y'all are going to be protected whatever you're working on is going to be protected you're going to some of y'all i'm getting y'all gonna be making money in y'all sleep for some of y'all because the girl is sleep some of y'all gonna be making money in y'all sleep some of y'all gonna be um getting more attention or more things happening for you guys more options when it comes to career fields more options in love you know more options when it comes to picking out accessories having the finances for certain things that you want this is the energy your dreams are going to start coming through but not only are they going to be coming through they're going to be coming in quickly and now it's going to start pissing people off because they're going to feel like what are you doing you are doing something and then you know people are going to feel like they're being left behind in some kind of way they're also going to feel like and you can just be doing this for you so the thing is is i'm getting yeah whatever you're doing you're working really hard for hard for you know you you working really hard for it and whatever's destined for you is already destined for you so it's nothing that these people can do but only watch but i'm getting this energy where people are going to be pissed off off of these two cards is because your dreams things happen they're going to start happening for you things are going to start coming easy like sliced bread they're going to feel like damn power one got it made power one got it easy but they didn't see your struggles and some of you guys it's crazy because some of y'all i'm getting at these people seeing your struggles and they still mad because it's you that's the crazy thing like some of y'all people have not seen your struggles and they think you just got where you are overnight or they think you didn't put no fucking hard work in or put no you know to get where you are you know they looking at it from oh i want to be like you and i want uh, some kind of envious type of shit and they're going to be pissed off they're going to want you to dim your life for them to fit in for them to feel good and they're not going to want to congratulate you or they're not going to want to show much you know attitude towards it positive energy towards the uplifting energy because they're going to feel some kind of way so this is who you're going to be this is why you're going to piss the people off with your blessings who are you going to be pissing off with your blessings why are you going to piss any people off with your blessings We got home. Some of you guys, you're going to be pissing people up because you're going to be moving and getting a new home. Some of y'all going to be purchasing a new home this year. Um, Some of you guys are going to be selling a home this year. For some of y'all, I'm getting real estate because we do got dreams. Some of y'all, y'all could be want to do real estate. Some of y'all could want to do things around like cooking. Y'all could want to cook. Y'all could want to do things where it resides around home. It don't necessarily have to be real estate. It could just be like you want to sell pots or you know, you want to sell candles or you want to sell certain things, pillows. You want to make certain clothes clothes you know interior things you know some of y'all y'all i'm getting heavily energy on some energy like that for a couple of you guys if this is not you it's okay you know but i'm just getting energy for the ones that's coming through but anyways y'all gonna be feeling more home you know what's crazy uh Power one, another reason why people are going to be pissed off at your blessings because you're going to be secure. I'm getting stable. Like, your home is going to be very stable. Bills paid, secure, locked in. Things are going to be flowing good for you. Um, I'm also getting that you're going to be making your home feel like a home. Some of y'all are going to be revamping it, making it look really nice, you know, styling it up. Some of y'all are going to be moving into a new home, having a new shift, having something new for yourself. Some of y'all are going to be selling a home. Um, some of y'all are going to be building a home for some of you guys. And this is the energy why people are going to be upset or going to feel some type of way. You're going to start growing in places that is going to show. And the thing about it, Power One, is it's going to show in these people's face. That's the thing about it. No one's going to be able to be like, oh, Power One, this or that. It's almost this energy where it's like somebody get like, say for instance, somebody get a new home. And you see somebody like, oh, your home, oh, okay, that's nice, you know, like that. But it's like, bitch, I just got a whole new home. Like, I just up and move, you know. And you know, not that other people have to care, but that to me, I don't think that's a big deal. You know, you just move to a new home, you know. You know, so it's just, it's, that's just an example. But it, that could be the case. But it's just the energy where it's just like... People are going to start feeling some type of way because not only are you progressing, but you're progressing and you're making big purchases or you're progressing in big areas, you know, making big moves. This is y'all year I'm hearing of y'all making big moves, doing new things. That's a new shit for some of y'all. Some of y'all mapping out game plans or y'all, you know, got your eye on things y'all want to do and somehow, somewhere are going to get to end up doing it this year. And this is going to start pissing people off. This is why your blessings are pissing people off. This is why when they come in, they're going to be pissing up because you're going to be stable or going to be in your own 
own home you're being are feeling very secure very stable your dreams are coming through they're coming in fast you're achieving things things are just flowing really good for you you know it's like sliced butter like things are going i'm getting like somebody rolling the fucking bowling ball into pins and they hit them all you are literally hitting the goals literally you are oh all these cards to fit but it's like i'm hearing life's good when I hear that life's good by future, that means your bills is paid, your life is good, you know, things are starting to happen for you, you the more money, you're progressing in great areas, you're happy where you are, yeah, like, that's the energy, you're gonna be sending, some of y'all, your female will be sending pretty, that's the energy, you're gonna be sending really pretty, very polished, your hair will be done, if you like your hair to be done, nails done, if you like to cater to yourself, I'm hearing that, um, that is the energy of my masters. You're going to be keeping yourself up, you know, looking really sharp, you know, fresh as fuck, you know, getting the things that you want to get done, you know, making moves, making money moves, progressing in money areas, you know, it, you'll be, it's going to be a heavy energy on y'all having a really big level up. Y'all going to be having a really big level up and you having a level up is going to start triggering people around y'all because it's like, whoa, I'm here. Who you in front of? Slow down for what? You know, it's this energy where people will be like, damn, like what you doing you know we got the help from above and letting go so some of you guys people are going to be upset that you're not taking their advice on things people are going to feel like you should do what they want you to do or they feel like they know what's best and then y'all do what y'all want to do and then they end up seeing what you did was best for you so it's almost like you're going to be making people that feel like they know it all or feel like they have to have a say you're going to be showing them like or people that stuck on things only can be done a certain way i'm getting this energy when people can think small like oh you can only do certain things a certain way you can only be successful this way you only could do things this way they will be putting a fucking foot in it my hold on y'all door dash here hold on got that y'all okay so we got the um hell from above and letting go so some of you guys i'm also going to for some of you guys you're going to be letting go of people as well you are going to start meditating you're going to start realizing that certain people are not giving the areas that you are giving to them you may start realizing that you are doing more for others that may not be doing as much as you. You are going to start letting go of people that's more of a burden than adding in your life. And that's going to start triggering these people when your blessings come in. It's going to piss them off because it's like they're not going to be a part of it. They're not going to be getting any like they were before. And it's going to be like, damn. And then it's going to be better than what you was giving them before. It's going to be like, damn, like, I wish I could have some of that. Like, you can't be that other shit. What about this? You know? So that's the energy. People are not going to have access to you as much as they was able to. It's going to be really minimalistic, moving accordingly. So that's the energy I'm getting. So we're about to get some more messages. Ancestor of God, Holy Spirit. How, how is power one blessing going to piss people off? How is power one blessing going to piss people off? psychic terrorist astrologist so some of you guys you can begin terror reading for some of you guys um uh, some of you guys y'all can be terror readers or into astrology and that's going to start pissing people off they're going to start being pissed off because they're going to over oh, some of you guys again the people are going to feel like you did something to pull blessings in like maybe like you didn't did some type of witchcraft or something like that to pull your blessings in for some of y'all this is what they're thinking this is um, what people are going to start saying for some of you guys especially if, if you're like into spiritual things or they're going to feel like oh like you did something behind the scenes and regardless of whether you did or not it's just an energy where it's like you are literally going to be working very hard for what you want no one's going to be able to say that they you know you did anything the work and the proof is going to be in the pudding it's just these people are not going to want to give you their your light or they're not going to want to really congratulate you on your shit for real because it's you you know that's the energy i'm getting Oh, we got thick, nice body can do on hair. So some of you guys, another reason I'm pissed, people are pissed about your blessings for some of you guys, because some of y'all could be losing weight. Some of y'all are gaining weight and people are starting to take notice. And for some of you guys, I'm getting this energy where it's kind of like, uh, because it's like the way people think, but I'm getting this energy where people are, if you are losing weight, and this is specific for people that's losing weight or gaining weight. If you're losing weight or gaining weight, people are feeling some type of weight because they're starting to feel like maybe before, you know, I'm getting this energy or maybe before like they, oh, for instance, oh, well, 
I'm okay, but you know me, I keep her honey on this motherfucking channel. So we just get into a power one. Fuck it. Anyway, it's gonna be this energy where people are gonna start feeling like you're a threat in some kind of way. They're gonna start feeling like you're feeling yourself. Some of y'all gonna be changing your wardrobe, wearing different things. If you're a masculine, you're gonna be able to wear certain things that you want because of losing weight or gonna be bulking up more. It's just this energy of changing your body, changing, you know, changing things and you know, working hard for the things that you have. It could be this big shift and people are gonna be like, damn, power one is starting to be a, a more of a threat. Like you already was a threat because you are able to have what you want but they're going to start feeling like you're really a threat because you're starting to you know fall in love with yourself more really self-love caring about yourself more it's going to start showing you're going to be so much more confident for some of you guys and it's going to be start pissing people off how confident you are becoming they're going to they're gonna start feeling like it's almost when it's like they're going to start i ain't gonna catch some of you guys i don't know why i'm hearing this but i'm getting duff I'm getting duff, like, and I'm not saying this is y'all, but I'm getting this energy where it's like, I'm. If y'all know what duff is, it means the ugly fat friend. Okay, that's what it means. I mean, I'm being real on this channel. Be keeping one hundred. So I'm getting duff, and duff could just be me. You know, like you could be a bigger weight than other people. So and then you can be like half friend, just maybe like slimmer or stuff like that. And this can resonate for literally specific people. And regardless of that's the energy, some of you guys are, are some of you guys, it's not even about you being bigger. Maybe you would have had a certain clothes or maybe you would have had to have certain things that actually were the true potential things that you want to wear, you know? So it's this energy where you're going to start wearing certain things. Some of y'all I'm getting, y'all going to be getting thick. Like some of y'all going to be gaining weight in the right places thighs but bread well, i don't know it's just in the right places you know and people are going to start feeling some type of way they're going to start feeling like you're a threat you're going to be like damn power one. it's y'all having a glow up fuck it y'all having a glow up power one and it's really going to start triggering people part of your blessing is having a glow like i'm not getting no 180 i'm getting like a 360 like if you got a car or home that's up being upgraded things are changing you're going to begin out more this year vacation and more it's like a lot of goals are going to be set because you're going to fall through with your plans some of you guys i'm also hearing that if you are making plans with other people and it didn't go through you're going to start planning things by yourself and you're going to meet people along the way and it's going to start pissing people off because they're like oh you would invite me but they would but then it's like but you ain't you ain't come to times i did invite you you know that's the energy i'm getting it's, it's a lot of it's a lot of things being replaced in your life it's like oh this is being replaced with this and people are going to start be like oh pa one i'm getting people are going to feel like you're at the funny some of you guys your hair is going to be really nice this year hair going to be looking slayed looking good keeping yourself up you know really good we got always getting the newest products in store oh always getting the newest products in store people are going to be pissed because y'all gonna be getting the newest products in store literally people are going to be pissed and part of your blessings is getting new shit at the store like some of you guys have new shoes come out you're gonna be able to cop them bitches when they first come out you're not gonna have to wait until the price drop or if you want to get something you're gonna have the finances to get it you know this shit is coming in for you guys and this is why you're gonna start pissing people off with your blessings why is my problem gonna piss people off with their blessings let me get some more energy why are they pissing people off with your blessings okay we're not taking all these cards i'm taking this on the top we have to get some more energy. If I keep pulling one card, we probably get like four cards. Why is my power one pissing people off with their blessings? So we got four cards. Okay. Okay, we got can fight, but cool as fuck. Well, respect us. So people are going to start being pissed off because of how respected you are by other people. It's going to be this energy. Ooh, this is coming in. This is coming in heavily heavily oh my god so for some of you guys this is the energy i'm picking up this is not gonna resonate for everybody for some of y'all it's gonna resonate for you all of y'all just in different ways so take it how you need to be taken some of you guys are getting this energy where there could be people that just so bit on not supporting you or so bit on going against you because it's you right whatever reason it could be because these people are jealous um it because the people don't want you to do good and they feel like that you need to dim your light and it's so funny because the energy is, is these people are going to be upset because you're so respected by other people. It's this energy where it's like, you could be around a surfer group of motherfuckers, a surfer group of people, and they kind of act funny. You don't have to necessarily be, um, it could be family, friends, uh, lo lovers, family, you know, your, your, your base family. It could just be anything, you know, it could just be, it could be work school i don't know it could just be your uh, energies or it could be certain individuals that's in different areas but they all act the light it's this energy some of you guys it could be different people but they kind of act the same you know it's the energy i'm getting but what i'm getting is it's like 
say I'm, I'm gonna give y'all an example it was any of you where it's like certain people don't support you and then they find out how many more people support you they feel like a oh, dumbass so that's the energy i feel like people are pissed about your buses because you're very well respected and some of you guys are going to be defending yourself more standing up for yourself or setting certain boundaries more being firm on your boundaries treat people how they treat you you know giving what's given to you but i'm getting this energy where it's like people will be like oh i don't know problem one was the shit it's this energy with somebody got something to say or they're snarky or they're very sly you know you, you can tell they low-key fake or or you know you can tell by their face or you can just tell that they low-key a hating ass motherfucker and it could be a group of people multiple people and they find out that you're very well respected by other people that other people really fucking like you and that pisses them off it's like whoa people actually fucking like you it's like when people think somebody is it's like when people bully somebody that they think people don't like oh people actually like you and they start feeling stupid because it's like now it's it's almost like how is this oh for some of you guys it's like people are looking in the mirror people are like i wonder how people will look at me if they found out that i've been a person that's going against power one and everybody respect power one that's the energy so i feel like people are going to start noticing that people respect you or people fuck with you in certain aspects it may not even people that you know it could be supporters it could be friends it could be people um strangers that don't even know you work hard it could be anybody it's just a simple fact that people are going to start noticing that you're very well respected by other individuals and you are not somebody to play with and it's almost like you don't want to be the person that's known for fucking with somebody pop i mean you know because it's just like they got the upper hand a kind of in a sort of way you know that's kind of what i'm getting we also got bougie sex appeal well endowed so some of you guys heavy emphasis on your motherfucking body power one i don't know who you are whether you're masculine or feminine we look bougie sex appeal well endowed i'm here bitches want to be like me okay some of you guys people are gonna be pissed because of your body people are gonna be pissed because of your beauty the way that you look if you're a masculine you're gonna be fucking handsome you're handsome people are gonna feel some type of way when you're around it's gonna be tension they're gonna fuck you have more than them or they're gonna want you to dim your light because you're around them some of you yeah some of you guys are gonna be looking like some of you guys have a really nice fucking aesthetic i don't know who you are whatever you your word job is some of y'all really dress your ass off just really nice some of you about to have the money to really dress the way you want to dress and i feel like it's about to start pissing people off like y'all ruffling feathers because of the way that you look how you are presenting yourself this confidence being other people are going to want to start looking like you other people are going to want to start dressing like you or seeing how you dress and it's going to start making other people feel some type of way because they're going to feel like oh i was the shit till power one came around that's the energy gossip fake friend up uh, for some of you guys you have a fake friend for some of you guys so the gossip car a fake friend some of y'all have a fake friend that tells your business for some of you guys or and you're going to be realizing it's out some of you guys you're going to um realize that a friend could have been gossiping about you because we got fake friend gossip op so this is somebody that's an op it could be acquaintance it could be a friend you're going to be realizing somebody somebody that is some you're gonna realizing that your friend is one of these people that's jealous some of you are going to be realized that you have a friend around you or somebody acquaintance or somebody around you that is jealous of you that's a hater that's really don't have your back or have good intentions for you somebody that want low-key wants to be you we also got music head clumsy dramatic blow um blow start over How the fuck I know that I world? It's my shit. Okay, so yeah, y'all, we got blow dramatic, blow stuff over proportion. Proportion. So some of you guys, there could be somebody around you that always blow things over proportion. There, it's like they, it's like they look for, it's like they look for areas to plan drama. It's like they blow things over proportion. They do the most. They always gotta be loud or have attention. Yeah, some of y'all just could be like an attention seeker. This could be somebody around y'all. This could resonate for specifically a couple of y'all. This could be somebody that blow things over proportion. It could be a friend. Um, this could be somebody that just, just negative or like it could be something small and they miss take it for something else just blowing things over proportion just doing too much this is somebody that you're going to realize that does not have the best intentions for y'all and that's gonna resonate for some of y'all in a different way it's not gonna resonate for some of y'all some of y'all won't resonate we got sexy freak heavy emphasis on how attractive you are i cannot 
I literally like three quarts and came out about how fine y'all are, how attractive you are, your body, how sexy you are, the way you dress. It's literally so much energy coming out. So that's going to be a really big thing that you're going to notice about people around you is that once you start dressing or doing certain things differently or some of y'all could just put earrings on, get a tattoo, you know, just change your haircut. It's going to be something simple for some of y'all. For some of y'all, y'all losing weight, y'all gaining weight. And it's going to start ruffling people's feathers. Like, whoa, you're just going to be looking really good, really beautiful, really handsome. We got trauma, trust issues, overthinker. So some of you guys, you're not going to have no all that overthinking for some of you guys. You're no longer going to be overthinking. You're no longer going to be having trouble when it comes towards these people. You're going to be doing what the fuck you. I'm here. I do what I fucking want. I don't need your opinion. Yeah, I don't need your opinion. Yeah, I do what I fucking want. By Rico Nasty, y'all doing the fuck y'all want. Okay, I'm here for don't make money. It don't make sense. Literally, that's what type of time I get that y'all own. We got not authentic loss being somebody, someone that they're not. So some of you guys, people are going to try to make it seem like you're being somebody that you're not. They're going to try to make it seem like, oh, power one being somebody that they not. Oh, oh, or I'm hearing, oh, you know what I'm getting, power I'm getting somebody bless them. Oh, so how was your little business going? How was your little car going? Somebody that's trying to minimize, somebody that put little in front of you. How was your little house doing? You know, trying to, you know, downplay what you got going on, basically. And then we also got not authentic loss, being someone or not. So people are going to try to make it seem like you're being somebody that you're not. We're going to try to make it seem like, oh, probably one bad, the funny ever since they got this and that. Basically trying to make you feel bad for growth. Trying to make you feel bad for working hard for things. We also got racist, shit talker, wanting a reaction from you. So some of you guys, this could be somebody that wants a reaction from you. And if some of you guys, this could be somebody that's racist. Somebody could feel like you shouldn't have the things that you had because of your skin tone. And you had the things that you had because you worked hard for it and it feels some type of way. And that's going to resonate for some of you guys in a different way. For some of you guys, somebody could want a reaction out of you. Or some of you guys, people are going to want a reaction out of you. They're going to want you to scoop down on their level. Because I'm getting, you have shit to lose, they don't. This is somebody that probably don't have them as much shit as you, or you're starting to have more shit than them, and your shit is bigger to lose than what they shit is. So now they want to start something because they want to put you down where they are. That's my own business. Hey, drama. Some of y'all, y'all be minding your own fucking, y'all gonna be minding your own business, and it's gonna be pissing people off. You minding your own business, you staying out the mix, go bother people. For some of y'all, I'm getting this specifically, whether you're masculine or feminine, you are gonna be around a group of people, and you're gonna be staying to yourself, and you're gonna be pulling so much attention that it's gonna cause other people to be upset because they're gonna be doing a lot. Yeah, for some of you guys, blow things out of proportion. Yeah, for some of you guys, there could be somebody that's doing a lot for attention. And you're going to be doing the littlest shit, just chilling. And you're, and it's like people are going to be attracted to you for whatever reason. This person is going to piss this person off because they're going to feel like, what is it about power one that they can sit in a corner and not do nothing? I'm over here doing the most and nobody's, you know, noticing me. Or somebody could be working on something and you could be working, worry about yourself doing your creation. This person worry about your creation, worry about what you got going on instead of worry about what they got going on. Wondering, you, it's this energy where somebody... Worry about your happiness is fucking up your happiness. You know, the thief of joy. They worry about what you got going on is fucking up what they got going on. They worry about how you getting attention and it's bothering them because they feel like it's it's conflict now. So y'all gonna be y'all gonna be fine pissing people off regardless. We also got new job or income, new tax bracket. I told y'all, money's going to be looking good for y'all this year. Money's going to be looking good in general. You're going to start pissing people off by your new job. More income coming in from an outside source. More income again because you'll be getting a promotion. Some of y'all going to be entering a new tax bracket, making more money than what you was making before. And this is going to start pissing people off because you're going to start, I'm here, I'm, I'm living the good life. Yeah, don't throw your hands up in the sky. My, You know, I'm still sick, y'all, so it's horrible, y'all. It's horrible. You're like, girl, what the fuck? I'm like, what the fuck, too? Shit, I didn't know what's going on. You, you know how you, me, you have your headphones on, you're singing, and then you take that shit off. You're like, oh, Lord. We got having a glow up. Oh, my fucking God. Yo, I didn't even, like, realize I read that until I had to realize I read it. Y'all heard that, right? Having a glow up. Going through a secure, upgraded life. I already told you y'all was having an upgrade. And Nick Carr came out literally saying y'all having an upgrade, y'all having a glow up. Literally said that earlier, and I was backing it up. The car fucking came out. Y'all are having a fucking glow up. You are pissing people off because you're having a fucking glow up. Your life is being more stable. You, th This is not no little shit, okay? 
this is not no i'm here i don't know why i'm here and pull up in the street locker when a girl said what and mama nikki said pull up in the street locker and that's the energy i'm getting where it's almost like you are having upgrade secure there's not gonna be no misinterpret of anything you're secured power one upgrade is coming through love is coming in for you guys and this is why this is pissing people off so this is why people are mad power one this is why people are gonna be mad about your blessings when they come through because it's nothing they can do you having a glove and it's starting to piss people off because they thought they was doing something not only is, i'm here i'm on a new level i'm on a new level my future Lots of friends, your mutual friends. So, yeah, some of you guys, these are people that are, some of you guys, these are friends that you're friends with. Some of you guys, these are mutual friends of other people's friends. So, you could be friends with somebody that could be their friend that's hating, you know. But take what resonates. Some of you guys are going to get a, a new group of friends for some of you guys. I'm getting like, I'm getting specifically like if there's people that never want to do certain stuff or never able to do certain things when it's time you're going to end up have meeting people that are going to be on the same tip you want by you doing it by yourself you're going to meet people um part of the thing we also got lgbtq for some of you guys people may be pissed that you are somebody that's open if you are somebody that's part of lgbtq they're upset that you're open and this could be somebody that's not open this could be specifically for a couple of you this is somebody that's not open or they don't some of you guys, this could be somebody that, okay, oh, y'all, yes, that's what it is, uh, okay, I'm getting three different messages, so earlier, y'all, that racist card came out, and racist, some of you guys, it doesn't even have to be somebody racist at your skin tone, it could be somebody else said that you're openly gay, or openly, you know, who you are, openly upset about who you are, mad, worried about what you're doing is fucking up their happiness, worry about you, so some of you guys, this is why somebody is pissed, they could be upset that some of y'all, somebody's upset that you're openly gay, and they're not openly gay, and you're close off, and it's like, you're, they kind of could be living through you, for some of you guys, and you living what you wanted to do, what you want, they could be upset about that, some of you guys, you know, this could be somebody that wants to criticize you and somebody might want to make you feel small or leave you out because of the sex that you like or the your know, sexual orientation or who you are be the fucking bitch that's the energy i'm getting for some of you guys and that's gonna resonate for specifically a couple of you always against you have favoritism for some of you guys somebody could try to make you leave that make you feel left out on purpose so this can go for the message i just said for y'all and then for some of you guys, it could be at a workplace a friend group it could be family i don't know could, somebody around you could be trying to make you feel left out and they could have favorites for some of you guys, I'm getting like a Bella and Gigi Hadi, where the mom likes Gigi but don't like Bella. I'm getting that for some of you guys. Some of you guys, it's not literally like that. It's not literally a parent. It's just other people. It could be coworkers. It could be friends, a friend group, um, acquaintances, a group of acquaintances, you know. But it could just be this person I, I just said it too that want to make you feel left out. And wanna, it's like they want to like praise other people but make you feel left out. But they don't want to pray. And then it's like you doing better than other people, but they want to praise smaller people because they just don't want to. It's you. It's just fucking you. This person just they don't like you. Sugar baby only fans. For some of you guys, somebody could be upset that you have an only fans. They can be pissed that you are making money only. Or some of you guys, somebody's pissed that you are very attractive where you can make money off only fans. You can do what you can do, and they're upset about that. So take what resonates with what doesn't, but this is your reading. This is why people are pissed about your blessings, power one. You know, if you find this reading resonate, hit the like button, comment down below. Until next time. Welcome to my channel, so please give the power two. If you find that this reading resonates with you, please hit the like button. Please comment down below. Please subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so you never miss out on any of my uploads. Also, if you're a new subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate you. If you're a return subscriber, gang, gang, welcome back. Les, I love you all. Thank you so much for supporting. If you're inquiring about personal readings, everything is listed down below in the description box. Or further ado, we're going to have running two or the same show of cards and shuffle over the decks. Who are you going to be pissing off for sure? Blessings, Pile 2. Now, Pile 1 was real. Woo! Pile 1 got motherfuckers mad. But for some of y'all, I'm getting a telefriend. To tell a friend she's back. Some of you guys, this is energy where some of you guys are like back. Like some of you guys, I'm getting y'all back to your old self. I'm hearing also by Jan by Janae and her back up on my bullshit, back up on the scene. Some of you guys, y'all could have just recently got out of a relationship not too long ago. Some of you guys, you could have got a relationship some time back, and you know you starting to step out. You know, step out more. Some of you guys, you're just getting back to yourself. Some of you guys, you're focusing on your goals, focusing on your dreams. You are starting to feel more like yourself, or this is starting to come in is the shift that's about to start coming in 
again. And the fun of this is going to start ruffling people's feathers. It's going to start pissing people off. I feel like it's getting this energy where it's just like you're going to be doing chew on, move it to your own video, your drum. Not sh Some of you guys are not. If you give a lot, you're not going to be giving as much as you were, were before. Really just... Some of you guys are going to learn how to be happy by yourselves in ways, and that's going to start pissing people off. People are going to feel like you don't need them. Some of you guys, oh, oh, yeah, for some of you guys, if you used to reach out to people more than they reached out to you, you're going to stop doing that. They're going to start feeling some type of way. You're going to feel like what you got going on. Some of you guys, if there could have been somebody... I don't know why that's coming up in my mind. It could have been somebody that was kind of rejecting some of y'all. Or they weren't rejecting y'all. They could have just been breadcrumbing in some kind of way. Specifically for a couple of y'all. This is just energy I'm picking up specifically. This person was kind of breadcrumbing you or rejecting you. Some kind of way. Or just making you feel like they were stringing you along for a couple of you guys. I'm getting. And I really feel like this person is going to start being pissed because this person it's this energy where somebody yes that's the fucking energy some of you guys i, I the energy coming through for a couple of y'all this is gonna resonate for a couple of y'all for the ones that's in relationship this can resonate for you too regardless um or oh, for some of you guys this whether you're in a relationship or not if you and your partner been arguing or if you were with somebody they could have been playing games or whatever this is for specifically this that type of situation for y'all if you or this is not a, if you and i in this situation right now it's okay i'm gonna get to you i'm gonna get to you okay don't worry let me get this message out real quick because we got way more to get into y'all because they pissed I'm here. I'm getting. I'm getting. Um, I'm getting a sweetie. Um, I think sweetie. Why? Um, why you pissed? So somebody need to go listen to sweetie piss. I think that it is. Why you pissed? Or why you mad? Or something like that. It's one of them. Um, y'all need to go listen to that so y'all can get maybe some messages in there for y'all. Oh, for some of you guys, yes. Okay, so some of you guys, and that song, Sweetie, Why You Pissed, basically, she was acting it. I don't know if y'all know who Daenerys is off of Game of Thrones. Now, if you know who Daenerys is off of Game of Thrones, that was a bad bitch, okay? And she knew it was, she, I mean, she died at the end, but regardless, that bitch held her throne. She held her own. She rose up. She held her own, okay? Let's just say that. And this is energy where I'm getting for some of you guys where it's just like, you hold your own. You carry your own. You you know, you always pick yourself back up when things go wrong. Things fall out for you guys. You pick yourself back up. But I'm getting this energy where it's like, people are going to be pissed about you, Pile 1. I mean, oh, some of you need to go watch Pile 1. But Pile 2, people are going to be pissed because you are going to start not really needing people, basically. They're going to start feeling not needed by you. And then again, back to that whole breadcrumbing situation. This is somebody that's breadcrumbing you, or if they, or or if you are in a relationship with somebody and y'all been arguing, not seeing eye to eye, husband, boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever, I don't care, wife, or somebody could have making you feel left out or string you along, you're gonna start taking your power back from that situation. Regardless of how you take your power back, or some of you guys again specifically that this person or this somebody you're in a relationship with, or if this is somebody that you know was playing games or break coming and streaking you on they're going to realize that you are the shit and that's kind of crazy because it's, it's energy where somebody's going to be reminded that you're still that bitch or you're still that guy you know that's the energy i'm getting like if somebody was trying to downplay you or trying to make it seem like you are not what you are or you're not or you know you're not the shit it's this energy where motherfuckers are, or whoever this person is, well, this is somebody that you, if you and your person been arguing, they're going to realize, like, let me tie my shit up because motherfuckers really want my person out here. Or I'm stringing this person breadcrumbing them, but there's people that really want this person out here. Let me tighten up. Let me stop playing games. This is the energy I'm getting for some of you guys. So that's into the energy. So we're going to get into it, these cards. Why are people pissed? Why are people going to be pissed by my power two and their blessings? What are they pissed about? We got entrapment. Yeah. For some of you guys, I'm getting heavy on that, that energy. The people could have, some of you guys, people could have wanted you to feel trapped. They could want you to feel left out. Or they could want you to feel trapped or controlled. Or they could want to control what you do. Or control certain things in your life. They could want you to do certain things that they wanted you to do. Or they just wanted you to feel trapped. Like you couldn't do certain stuff. Like things were only going, done a certain way. Some of you guys, it could be emphasis on like a relationship or somebody that you liked it. And somebody could have tried to control you or they were. This could be somebody that likes to have control over situations. They like to be in their ego. They like to have control. And this person is going to be pissed when they are no longer having access to control you. Some of you guys are going to start falling in love with yourself more. Being able to be more independent. And that's going to piss people off and specifically whoever this person is. 
We got courage. Yeah, for some of you guys, you're going to start being brave, having the courage to go after the things that you want, having the courage to stand on your own feet. Some of you guys, if you are sharing apartments with somebody, or sharing finances, you're going to be able to do it on your own. Some of you guys, if you're raising kids by yourself, you're going to be able to do it on your own. It's this energy where you're going to start stepping into doing stuff by yourself and being more independent, not needing other people. And that's going to start p pissing people off. Some of you guys, you not being trapped or you not being stuck or needing to rely on people is going to piss them off because they can want to control you. They can want you to be like a puppet or like a minion or something like that. And it's going to be like, yeah, for some of you guys, I'm also getting that there could be somebody that wants to sabotage something that you got going on. Some of you guys, each time you try to start something or each time you try to get something to float or new, there could be something that tries to sabotage what you got going on or try to stop what you got going on. Because I'm looking at the way this lady is trying to grab the lantern and the lantern is the light. If without the lantern, it's going to be dark. And he needs the lantern to see and she looks like she wants to grab it like she's looking. So for some of you guys, this is the energy I'm getting. For some of you guys, I'm getting that somebody wants you to not move on. They don't want you to move on for them. They want to control things. Some of you guys, somebody, it don't have to be a lover. It could be a friend. They want you to, it could, also I'm getting so many messages. So I'll take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Some of you guys, it could be a friend that does not want you to hang out with other friends. They can want you to only be their friend, only be around them. Or it could be a clingy friend for some of you guys. Somebody that asks for a lot of things, are very needy or somebody that um always, you know, just needs something. For some of you guys, it could just be a lover it could be somebody that you know is slowing you down you know or somebody that wants to control things or have certain or want you to do certain things in a certain way or it could be somebody that wants to dictate or make all the moves or something like that or just make you feel controlled or trapped or some kind of way so be like this be a living situation or it could be family it could make people can you know want you to need them or or want you to move to the beat of their drum not to your own you know, some of you guys, this could be the energy where somebody always wants to, some of y'all, y'all can hang out with somebody that always wants to do things but that they want to do, but never want to do what you want to do. Some of y'all could be energy like that. It's like people can want you to revolve yourself around what they're doing and you're not. You're focusing on yourself. Things are starting to work out for you. Things are starting to level up for you. You're having a lot of courage. You're very brave. Things are starting to take off for you. You're, you're not trapped. Some of you guys, you got obstacles in, oh, for some of you guys, people are pissed at the fact that things are starting to move out the way. Some of you guys, if you need the money for something, you got the money for it. And people could have been happy when you didn't have the money for it. They're like, oh, yeah, Pow 2 ain't got the money for that shit. Now Pow 2 got to come ask me. Or now Pow 2 stuck. Or now Pow 2 in this position. It's this energy where people want, people feel like you're a threat. That's the energy. People feel like you're a fucking threat, Pow 2. Like, this is the whole energy in this reading. You are a threat to people. People feel like if you are up or moving on your feet, you are making big moves. And they feel like when you are down, like, for instance, like a car broke down. A car being up in this drive, you can get to where the fuck you need to get to. But when it's broke down, you having challenges. You have challenges getting places. People can want you to have certain challenges so you don't upgrade, so you don't elevate. And people are being pissed because them challenges are constantly being removed. It's like people could be trying to throw rocks to hide their hands, try to do certain things getting away on certain aspects and it's like you constantly keep growing nothing's slowing down for you nothing's not working out for you and people are upset about this people are getting pissed because you are starting to be, you're not being controlled you are i'm here let me drive the boat people can want to drive your boat they can want to be like no let me drive the boat and it's like no this is my fucking boat get your own boat the fuck that's the energy. Yeah, we got temptation in reverse. For some of you guys, if you would like to somebody or you was like really a threat or you thought or you was head over heels for somebody, you are starting to lose that attraction to them. You are, It's starting to fade. And this person is pissed because it's like they, this person cares about how you view them. Regardless of how this person treat, and this specifically will resonate for a couple of y'all. Regardless of how this person treated you, they care about how you view them. Because of how you are viewed by others. This could be this energy where somebody can want to make you feel like you're not who you are. Try to make you feel like you're not a bad as fuck or make you feel like you're not handsome as fuck. Make you feel like you are not. I'm getting this energy where somebody forget that that's the person that everybody wants. And this person could be pissed that you don't see them in that way because other people see you as God's gift. And you probably could have viewed this person. Or you could have viewed this person in a high manner or you could have, you know, been head over heels for this person. But you're starting to lose that attraction for a couple of you guys. You're starting not to see this person because of their controlling antics. You know, or the, or some of y'all see this person being in and out. That's going to resonate for a specific few of you. For the other hand of you, for some of you guys, people are starting to feel pissed because the, of you being temptation. People are starting to feel like you're a temptation to other people. You know, people are starting to feel like you are having to get the gab or people are start, starting to like you. People are starting to notice you for some of you guys. <coughs> Sorry, I'm still getting over a cold. Uh, people, uh, some of you guys are getting this energy where somebody could be upset or pissed 
about the fact that you are starting to glow you're starting to be temptation to people or somebody could feel like you are starting to it's, it's it's this energy where you are starting to be a problem it's like you weren't a problem before or maybe they didn't look at you as a threat before and now you're becoming a threat you're starting to ruffle their feathers you know you're starting to get in the way of the things that they want for some of you guys and and you know this could be somebody somebody's pissed about that and they're pissed about you being somebody's pissed about you being who you are literally that's the energy we will get into some tarot in a minute but did another car fall by? I felt one, heard one, but we got self sabotage. Yes, for some of you guys, this is why somebody's upset. Somebody could be trying to sabotage you. Somebody could give you the wrong advice on a perp on purpose. So man, this is an energy about to. And this is what you need to know. Somebody or people around you are pissed because you don't need them. They're not able to control you. And all the reasons I gave y'all out before not needing certain things if you are somebody that always needs somebody to go out with you or travel with you or do certain stuff you gonna start traveling by yourself getting this energy with somebody see that you went out or hung out and they like oh you invite me or and that kind of came out of power one so i did tell y'all i may need to go watch power one or some of you guys could just be that energy where people are going to start feeling left out. Like, if you was depending on people to meet you halfway and they always fail and that caused you to miss out on things, you're going to start doing it by yourself. And you're going to start meeting people along the way that does, does it with you. So, some of you guys. That's what I'm seeing with the entrapment, with the courage card. Temptation and revert for the self sabotage. Just like these people. It's this energy where people want you to revolve yourself around, around them. Like, wait on them, you know? Some of you guys, oh, don't go out of state. Don't see that new thing till I can come with you. Or, oh, don't do this. Don't do that until I go with you. So people want you to wait on them. Some of you guys, it could be this energy where people think that you supposed to wait around when they say when it's time to go and when it's time to move. That's literally the fucking energy. It could be a lover that think you about to sit around and wait for them to heal or wait for them to get their shit together or a person. It could be somebody where somebody you somebody want you to wait until they get on your level or get on the level to it's like i'm not about to wait the fuck i could die any moment and i'm dying i'm gonna be dying waiting for you to get your shit together it's like people don't want to meet you halfway they want to want you to put your life on hold and wait for them. some of you guys people could not just be refusing to make certain situations or make decisions so since they're refusing to make decisions or choices they want you to wait you know, and they're pissed because you're no longer self-sabotaging yourself. You're no longer putting other people before yourself. You're no longer putting certain things in front of you. And you are starting to fucking grow. You're starting to be more temptation to people. You're starting to get be the gift of the gas. Some of you are starting to be the fucking flavor of the year. Starting to get the things that you want. Things starting to trap to you easily. Some of you got people are feeling replaced, you know. Feel like, I'm here, what you got going on? People want to know what you're doing. Some of you guys, if you was calling people on the phone and stuff like that and they weren't answering now they ain't starting to call you because now they want to know why you ain't been hitting them up yeah we gotta pay attention to the signs yeah for some of you guys you have been paying attention to how motherfuckers move and they didn't know and this is why people are pissed some of you guys you could people could have been doing shit that you didn't even react to people could have been doing certain shit and you peeped it but you ain't say shit some of y'all y'all been observing and people didn't even know you knew what you knew that is the energy that I'm getting. People, you've been paying attention to how people move. You've been paying attention to the signs. And people are pissed because they thought they could get one over you. Some of y'all people could have thought that they had one up on you. And the whole time you had six up on them. People are feeling defeated by you. We got the nine of pentacles. People are feeling the people are this energy. Self-fucking-reliant. Some of y'all are being more self-reliant on yourself not needing people and people are pissed to that people are pissed because you are having more wealth some of you if you have a business your business is about to start thriving more things are about to start attaching more increasing more some of you are about to start having more material securities more success having more achievement a lot of more achievement things are going to start you have a lot of more independence a lot of growth with this nine of pentacles and this is why people are pissed y'all are working your way up to the fucking ten of pentacles for some of you guys if you are not married for some of you guys or you are not in a relationship people are fucking pissed because all you need is a partner to complete your life they're like damn my problem pile two need is, is a partner yeah, we got the um three of swords in reverse. People are feeling like, oh, pile one. I mean, pile, oh, some of y'all watch pile one. People could be feeling like, damn, like pile two. All they need is this or that, and they good. They set. It's this energy. People feel like all you need is something, and you're set. You know. And this is why people are fucking pissed. People are pissed because you are self-reliant. Some of you guys, people can be pissed that you're independent and they're not. It could be people that don't have their shit together, and you got your shit together, or you getting your shit together, and they're pissed because they still don't have their shit together. 
Yes, y'all, this is the energy. Y'all are pissing people off. We got the emperor in reverse. Yeah, for some of you guys, it could be people that try to be manipulated, try to overdo their part, overdo their power, over try to control things, or try to tell you what to do. Or, or it could be people that think you probably do a thing with move when they say move or jump when they say how high, you know, or some shit like that. We got the page of cups. So for some of you guys, another reason why uh, some of you guys, another reason why some of you guys, you are no longer uh, listening to people. Some of you guys, people are pissed because you're not listening to what they say when it comes to your dreams, when it comes to certain things that you are passionate about, certain things that you have, that you have, that you're emotionally tied to. You're no longer, um pissing people you're you're in, yeah you're you're no longer listening to people and pissing people off for some of you guys people some of you guys somebody could be pissed that you are if you just started talking to somebody this can even happen right now and it's going to happen some of you guys are even going to start talking to somebody or you just started talking to somebody and this person is going to really have you smiling this person is really going to have your heads in the clouds really putting a smile on your face for some of y'all and there's going to be people pissed around you that you are happy it's this energy for some of you guys that there could be somebody that's upset about you being happy it's a kind of relationship or you being satisfied it's a kind of relationship maybe some some of you guys it could be somebody that have a bad partner and then you get a good partner and they're upset that you have a good partner or they feel like your partner is better than but that's who they chose to be with that's who they chosen to be with look see we got the five of wands see opposition conflict unruly obstacles struggles ego clash i cannot make this shit up somebody's gonna some of you guys you're gonna start talking to somebody and flirting with somebody they're gonna have you smiling and, and, and whatever and this could be somebody that's already in any relationship and their partner is like not as good as the person that you're with or talking to or there could just be somebody that cannot have a love life and you're going to be getting up you're going to get like the perfect partner they're going to view your per partner as perfect or treat you right and they're going to be upset they're going to be upset about the way that this person treats you the way that this person show love to you openly to me yeah, this could be somebody that's in something behind closed doors but mad about you being loved openly out loud literally the energy i'm getting for some of y'all and this is coming in like this is the energy that's coming in with the page of cups and the five of wands three of wands yes exploring hard work pays off some of you guys people are going to be people are going to be pissed because your hard work is starting to pay off for some of you guys people are going to flip yeah for some of you guys you're going to start getting new shit and then there's going to be somebody that some of you guys there could be somebody that's in secret competition with you there could be somebody that's in secret competition with a, like if you get a new car this person want a car or if you get a new pair of shoes now this person's like they got to get a new pair of shoes there's somebody around you that feels like your competition this person wants to they put themselves in competition because they feel like you're a threat they feel like you're better than them in some kind of way they feel like your life moves kind of way they feel like you they feel like certain things happen for you like you can you can be waiting for something to happen for three months but it happens like this person feel like shit happens for you things work out for you it could be people but i'm getting a specific person they can be a set that things work out for some of you guys we got aries for some of you guys we got water signs i got pisces for some of you guys some of you guys i got taurus but it can be this energy where people can be upset as a simple fact that whatever hard work or whatever you're doing, it's going to start paying off. Things you're going to start seeing progress. And people are going to start being pissed because they, some of you guys, people could have thought that something may not was going to work out. If you got a business or you starting something, they could have thought that it wasn't going to work out especially with the five of wands you know they could with well, this five of wands can also mean struggle. So for some of you guys, somebody could have thought that something that you were working on was not going to work out. And it's starting to work out and they're being pissed because it's like they could have thought that it wasn't no big deal. But now it's starting to be a threat because just like them, power tools accomplishing things and I'm not doing shit. Or I thought they, well, I thought that wasn't going to make them nothing. Or I thought it wasn't going to become anything. It's going to start pissing them off. Some of you guys, it could be literally a person that's putting yourself in competition. They could see that you're flirting with somebody or you like somebody. Somebody got their heads in the clouds and they could feel some type of way because they could feel like you are moving forward. They could feel like you ever some of you guys could be this energy where some people could have thought that you were somebody they weren't going to work out they could have thought that you were going to have struggles especially with the five of wands with the page of cups and the five of wands people could have felt like like if you were talking to somebody if you're in a relationship or you talk to somebody or you start talking to somebody people are going to start being pissed because they could have thought that this person was going to play you with the five put you know with the five of wands they could have thought that this person was going to put you in competition but the three wands because i was talking about dreams coming true or things moving forward moving forward or hard work paying off you know, or looking towards the future. Some of you guys, this person is going to actually want something serious with you. And it's going to start pissing people off because they're going to, some of you guys, it could be people that wanted this person and they're going to be with you and they could have thought that y'all wasn't going to work out and they're pissed because y'all working out. Some of you guys, it could just be a simple fact that it could be people that is upset 
and the simple fact that they could have thought something that you were doing you were going to struggle or wasn't going to work out and it actually started working out for you and now they're upset because they didn't think it was going to be a problem and now and now it's a problem yeah, we got the strength card. Yeah, for some of you guys, you are very brave. Some of you guys, you are, some of you guys, you could be losing weight for some of you guys because I do got the mind over matter. So some of you guys, or some of you guys, if you're not losing weight, some of you guys, y'all could have been saving up for something or you've been needing to have a lot of self-discipline and you're starting to have self-discipline. Some of you guys, if you could have been working harder than you plan, having more self-discipline to get to where you get want to get. Some of you guys, people are upset about that. People are upset about the fact that you have the strength to work. Like for instance, you want somebody that wants the business. You working hard to make your business come true. People are like, oh, I don't have the money to start a business, but somehow, some way, you come up with the money to start one. Or somehow, some way, you come up with the money to do certain things or make certain things work for yourself. And this is why people are pissed or they're upset. They're pissed and they're upset because things that you're doing is working out. You are being brave to go after things that you are want. You are being brave to open your heart again and love again. People are just upset. They're pissed at the simple fact that things are working out for you. And I think y'all literally need to hear that. And I keep saying it because y'all literally need to know that there are people around you that are praying on your downfall power too. People around you that are upset and pissed about your blessings. Your blessings is be you having an upgrade and people thinking that you weren't going to have it. And it's crazy because it's, it's people around you that could just really thought that certain things were not going to work out for you. Yeah, the Nine of Cups. I can, I mean, the second Nine of Pentacles came out, now the Nine of Cups are coming out. Y'all are having more success, stability, more abundance. Y'all are starting to be, some of y'all are satisfied. Some of you are happy with your life. Some of you guys, if you're not happy with things where they're going right now, you're about to, things are about to start going the way you need them to go to where you're able to live comfortably, able to actually be happy with your life, happy that things are going a certain way. People are starting to piss, people are pissed because you are starting to become happy. Paul, so you are starting to become happy with the things that you have. So we are starting to become happy because you are getting more things. God is blessing you. You have a lot of abundance that's coming in. And Nine of Cups can also stand for a happy relationship, which is granted a happy relationship, a, a relationship that satisfies you. Some of you guys, you're going to be meeting somebody that makes you feel like yourself. You're able to be yourself. You're comfortable. People are going to think that it's not going to work out between y'all and then it'll work out and they're pissed. Some of you guys, people could have thought that things weren't going to work out with you and your current partner and things are working out and people are pissed. Because they could have felt like y'all weren't going to work out. Some of you got people could have thought that that business or whatever you was doing, whatever dream, they said they could have felt like it was small or you could have just been starting off and you had shit and they could have felt like, oh, that shit ain't going to bring them nothing. Everybody try to do that, but nobody make it. Or, oh, just trying to minimize what you do and it's going to actually work out for you bigger than when you want to. Some of you guys, you're going to actually have the money with the nine of pentacles and nine of cups coming out. Nine of pentacles is talking about financial stability, being happy where you are financially, you know, progress when it comes to certain things that you're doing, when it comes to endeavors, money field, job. Just being great, have a good, good, good career, being in a good, secure position, you know, being very fruitful. But with the Nine of Cups coming out, that also, also tells about being satisfied in, in, in where you are at. So people, not only are you going to be happy with your money, happy with your job or your finances or your love life, but you're going to be satisfied. And that's going to piss people off. You being happy is pissing people off. Yeah, we got the Two of Cups. I can't make this shit. I told y'all, some of this is, this is a relationship. Some of you guys... There is some, some of you guys, you are going to be having a better relationship with people, a better relationship with people, a better relationship with a lover or somebody. People could have thought that you and this lover weren't going to work out. People could have thought that y'all weren't going to make it. Some of y'all people could have felt like you could have started dating somebody new and they could have thought that this person was going to cheat on you or put you in competition. But this person actually want to be with you with the two of cups. This person, y'all, you and this person are actually compatible. This person view you as soulmates for some of you guys with the two of cups. This person has a lot of feelings for you. This person wants a relationship with you or people thought that you weren't going to lead into a relationship with somebody. Some of y'all could have start off as f with buddies and they could have thought that you weren't going to be have a relationship out of this and you did i'm getting so many messages so heavy emphasis on a relationship working out in the future or working out yeah we got the four cuts for some of you guys i'm getting this specific mention for some of you guys your ex is pissed for some of you guys with the four of cups some of you guys somebody could have tried to come back and somebody is going to try to come back because that so because i'm getting this energy where this gonna resonate for a couple of you and not gonna resonate for everyone Okay, pile two. So the reason why you'll be pissing people off with your blessings is there could be an ex that's kind of reluctant, unhappy, they're upset, they're, they're stagnant. You know, there could be somebody that has a lot of regrets with the four of cups. 
This could be somebody that's waiting for you to call, waiting for you to text. This could be somebody that's stressed out. And it's specifically for a couple of y'all. For some of y'all, this could be somebody that you could have been head over heels with. And they could have been playing games, breadcrumbing you. And some of y'all are going to end up actually start fucking with somebody else. And this person is going to think because... The thing is, you're not going to view this person in the same way that you viewed them before. So, you're going, they're going to be trying to use how you viewed them the very first time. They're going to be thinking it's the same shit you want. But really, this person's not going to realize that you are asked to kind of move on from them or past them. It's going to be it's, it's this energy where somebody's going to be feeling like they should have did more when they had you. Or they should have did more when it was in your presence. They're going to feel like they waited too late to act on things. Or they waited too late to move their fucking feet. And, you know, some of y'all going to be talking to somebody else. Or and some of you guys are going to be finding somebody that's going to really match your vibe with you really well. And somebody else is going to think that they're going to have a turn. It's like somebody treats you like shit and then you get treated like heaven and think you about to leave that. You ain't about to leave that shit. Oh, we got the high end for car. For some of you guys, some of y'all, this is going to resonate for a couple of y'all. Some of y'all are going to actually end up getting married for some of you guys. And you're just going to be somebody pissed about the fact that you're getting married. Some of y'all are going to get proposed to by somebody. And somebody's going to be pissed by that. Some of y'all going to be somebody's ex that's pissed that y'all getting married. Or some of y'all, it could be your ex. It could be somebody that treated you bad and wrong. And this person could have planned on coming back or they're going to find out that you got proposed to. Or find out that you are in a higher level commitment. Yeah, with the nine of swords, this person's going to have a lot of disappointment, a lot of regrets. I cannot make this shit up out too. These cards are literally coming out. Nine of swords. This person's going to be regret, have a lot of guilt. Up all night. I'm hearing, got me up all night. Colin playing this love song. You're going to have this person in their fucking head all night. Thinking of you, some of you guys, that's the energy. Some of y'all get, ooh. But the hiring for car for some of you guys, that don't have to be the case. For some of you guys, that is the case. So I go get married or somebody's going to propose. Or this person that you're with is going to lead to marriage. Whatever y'all got going on is going to lead to marriage. Lead to y'all being more successful. And it's going to cause this person to be upset or cause this person to be mad or whatever. Whoever this person is, there are people gonna be be pissed or upset at the fact that something worked out for you, whether it's business. Cause the higher figure that's talk about a higher position in a job, a higher position in the work field, having more things better. You got mama jacket on? No, that's my jacket. No, no, no. But um, so that's really the energy. Um, the pal two people are gonna be upset. We got the three of cups that came up, but I'm gonna get to this three of cups in a minute for some of you guys. But this is why people are gonna be pissed. People are gonna be pissed because you're not being controlled, you're being self-reliant, you're gonna have a blow up when it comes to you and your and your look, being more sensation. Some of you guys you're gonna meet somebody new and people are gonna think that they're not gonna work out, they're gonna play you. And then this person is actually going to lead into marriage. For some of you guys, your relationship that you are in is going to lead to marriage. Or people could have thought that y'all weren't going to make it. And that's going to bother people. It's going to piss them off. Some of you guys, you're going to get a promotion or something bigger in a company. Or, or have better assets or more money coming in in some type of finance financial way. And it's going to start triggering people and piss them off. For some of you guys, there could be somebody that's going to regret. Somebody could have been breadcrumbing you or taking all day to move their feet. And they could have been trying to pretend like you weren't that bitch or, who, or you weren't that guy. That, like that everybody like pretend like everybody didn't want to be with you and they're going to be upset when they realize they're going to have a, a, a i'm getting an epiphany moment they are going to have a have a rude awakening when they realize that some of y'all somebody may even go as far as hitting on you right in front of this person or doing something to let this person know that or somebody sliding in your dm it could be something like that i don't know it's just somebody's going to have a rude awakening relapse and that you're still you're really you're really you're really high demand. A lot of people really want you, and it's going to start triggering this person. Some of you guys going to some of you guys. This person could be insecure that a lot of people want you, so they try to make you feel insecure. Some of y'all, and you're going to be letting that situation go. You're going to actually meet somebody that treats you better, and it's going to piss this person off because they're thinking they're going to come back. Some of you guys, you're going to get proposed to or get married, or again, it's going to lead to marriage. You're going to end up getting proposed to. So if you're already in a relationship with somebody, you're going to end up getting proposed by this person. For some of you guys, you're going to meet somebody that's going to lead into marriage, and it's going to start off as a lot of flirtation. We got the three of cups out, but, but, but before the three of cups came out, the nine of swords came out. So somebody, some of y'all getting multiple messages. Let me tell y'all, because some of y'all, this is about to resonate with a lot of y'all, but it's going to resonate with y'all in a different way. 
some of y'all pile too. People are gonna be upset and people are gonna be pissed. And let me tell y'all why they're gonna be pissed. Let me tell y'all why they're gonna be pissed. And I'm getting friends. This go for family. This go for lovers, exes. We got the three of cups and nine of swords. Some of you guys, people are gonna be regretting that they're not gonna be there to be able to celebrate with you. Some of you guys, if you are working on something, I I kept getting that somebody's gonna try to downplay whatever you're doing because it's you, because you got success going on or things are working out for you. And somebody's gonna feel some type of way because it's you. Or, or things are working out for you or you're successful or you got a lot of things going on people are going to be upset about that they're going to be pissed i'm getting that people that treated you a certain way let, made you feel left out kicked you when you were down didn't help you or you needed a little hand they didn't help you some of you some of y'all i even y'all could have looked out for people that didn't even look out for you when it was time for you to be needed help y'all are going to be in a position with the three of cups where you're going to be celebrating things are going to be going good y'all gonna be celebrating life goals achievements and people are not going to be there to appreciate that with y'all people are not going to be there it's this energy where people go wish they would have treated you when you were down some of y'all going to be y'all some of y'all going to be glowing up in y'all bag or y'all finances and y'all careers some of y'all y'all be able to have a position to put other people on and the same people that counted y'all out gonna be pissed because they're not there to celebrate that with y'all. They're not there to hear the music go. They're not here to hear the fucking music scene. The piñata pop. They're not here to see that. They're not here to um have that. Some of y'all people can't go where you're going and they're not gonna... It's this energy where people didn't know you were gonna end up where you were at and they're gonna wish they would've treated you better with the Nine of Swords and the Three of Cups. Some of you guys, you're going to be celebrating your wedding or celebrating your um what you got going on. That's something that you're going to be celebrating for some of you guys. And this is another reason. Some of you guys, I'm also getting that three cups can also mean third party. So some of you guys, somebody could even put you in a third party and you're regretting that the fact that they put you in a third party. Some of you guys, you're going to end up being married. You're gonna, Some of y'all are going to end up getting married by somebody. And the person, that, yeah, somebody that put you in a third party is going to be regretting how they treated you because y'all going to end up getting married by somebody else. It's it's this energy where one man's treasure is another one man's treasure is another man's treasure. Somebody could have treated you a certain way, put you in a third party. The person could have went out there, thought the grass was green, and found out that everybody out there low key liked them. So this person could have ended up got could have went out there and got beat up, bruised, and stepped on, or crushed, or whatever the case may be. And now they want to come back because they realize that your love was real, you was authentic, and you was different. But the person is going to be having a lot of disappointment or a lot of regrets when they realize that you're married or that you're in a higher level commitment or somebody is going to marry you. It's going to be like the doors, it's like it's too late. The doors are going to be closed. You will have something completely new going on and something way better, way healthier. So this is why your people are going to be pissed. You just got a lot of upgrades in your love life. Not only in your love life, we got the Ace of Wands, um, new growth positive growth going on new inspiration new beginning is happening more money coming in your talent is going to start speaking for yourself you got so much shit happening for you pal too it's, it's i mean they're mad yeah we got the page of swords and these people are going to have to watch these people are going to have to watch you glow up. These people are going to have to watch you grow up. These people are going to have to watch. For some of you guys, I'm getting friends, families, and lovers. People that was not fucking with you. People that put you in third-party situations. Breadcrumbs, you play games. People that wasn't being honest with you, wasn't being real. People that was moving funny or acting different or doing certain shit or whatever the case may be for some of y'all. Or just on some weird shit. Whatever the case may be, y'all. Whatever the case may be, or on some real shit. Um, uh, uh, whatever the case may be, that's on some real shit. Yeah, on some real shit. This is why people are gonna be mad. People are gonna have to start watching. Some of y'all people are gonna start gossiping what you got going on. Some of y'all people are gonna start being curious about what you got going on. They're gonna start watching. You people are gonna be watching you upgrade your life, and they're not. It's the same people that didn't help you gonna have to watch, and that's was the, it's gonna have to sting. Because they could, yeah, with the Knight of Swords, things are going to be moving fast for you. Things are going to start speeding up for you. They're going to have to watch things take off for you. With the Knight of Swords, with the fucking um, Page of Swords and the Knight of Swords, people are going to have to watch things take off for you. Watch things increase. I'm surprised the Chariot didn't come out. People are going to have to watch this growth. It's this energy where you can, certainly say for instance, you gain a certain amount of views. You may get a whole new, another new set of views. You may not, you may hit over the views you usually hit. World card, yes. Closing out cycles. Having more freedom. Completing things. Having more fulfillment in your fucking life. We got the Four of Cups. 
in reverse with the two of pentacles some of y'all got some of y'all are going to be you some of y'all gonna be happy you're not gonna be bored you your life some of y'all that's the thing people go feel like you got a lot of shit going on in your life your life is going to look fun compared to other people but the four of cups being in reverse and two of pentacles people go feel like you have plenty of options to choose from the people like oh pop to life oh it's like they got money they got a good lover they got things they can do you know they eat what they want to eat it's like people gonna be view you as living a good life now throw your hands up in the sky. This is why people are going to be pissed in part of your blessings. Because you're going to be look like you're living that dream life. I'm getting some of y'all go ahead and dream partner, the dream house, all that. Like, finance is good. Entering in different tax bracket. So we're going to get, let me see. Oh. Okay, y'all, this is it, y'all. Because I didn't realize I went over. But anyways, peace, love, and light. Beautiful, bigger, and most. Until next time.